X Play. Warhammer 40K is one of the most popular pencil and dice tabletop games that are out there. Mm -hmm. It just is. So then, how did developers bring Warhammer, which boasts meticulous strategy and careful planning, how'd they bring it to your console? Why, by making a first person shooter, of course. Of course! Okay, here's a review of Warhammer 40K for the PS2. Here is Terra, known to antiquity as Earth, the heart of the Imperium of Man. It is the 41st millennium, and there is only war. And yet, in 38,000 years of development, the cream of Earth's military might still hasn't mastered the tactic of not running straight at you while you mowed them down. Welcome to the universe of Warhammer 40,000, Fire Warrior. Warhammer started out as a tabletop strategy game, but for some unknown reason, it's been translated into a first-person shooter utterly devoid of strategy. You play Case, a young Tau warrior defending his world from the onslaught of the evil Earth Empire. Your species is the typical skinny green alien type. Thankfully, you hide your spindliness behind bright yellow armor because you need to present as obvious a target as possible to the poor, poor Earth soldiers. One thing you've got to give our great, 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 etc. grandchildren, they have utterly mastered the art of corridor design. Rooms are separated by as many long, twisty corridors as possible. And it looks like at some point, Earth's interior decorators were taken over by heavy metal fans, or maybe Skeletor, it's, it's hard to tell. And ducks. A good designer never forgets the ducks. Why are you guys just hanging out in a duct? Even when Fire Warrior steals from other better games, it can't quite get it right. There's your recharging shield, as seen in Halo. Unfortunately, it gets depleted in about a second, so it's not so useful. Then there's your ability to only carry two weapons at a time, also swiped straight from Halo. While this adds a nice touch of realism, it's hindered by the fact that you can't put down your default pulse rifle, even if you run out of ammo. So go ahead and grab that kick-ass BFG pistol. Enjoy watching your enemies burn up in blue flame. But be ready to scramble for a crappy rifle when your ammo runs out after a couple minutes of fighting. Okay, Fire Warrior is not a terrible game. Some of the levels are quite striking when you're not running down endless corridors blasting wave after wave from moronic soldiers. And fighting in corridors made for a terrific game in the 90s. But 38,000 years later, it's a little old. We give Warhammer 40,000 Fire Warrior a 2 out of five. It's over. Okay, in case you didn't figure it out, this is not a smooth transition from strategy to the PlayStation 2 for Warhammer, or its translation to the PC, which is befouled as well. We can just go home and play Call of Duty to cleanse our palates. Well, we can, because after the break, I get to talk to an American idol. Is it a girl idol? Yeah, she's pretty. Oh. Yeah.